All right, ladies, and welcome back. I am Sandra with the main event. Yesterday, we were talking about a ponytail. And the ponytail that I was talking about was the Vivica Fox bang and ponytail. I talked to you guys about how the hair um, tangles and there's a lot of flyaways. Um, I also wanted to come back to this ponytail because I wanted to let you guys know that you know, hey, it doesn't mean that all is lost because you can still use that ponytail. And as you guys know, I am very good with creating updos. So I decided to go ahead and do a updo demonstration with this ponytail, even though I've done this one in the past. But just in case, if you guys want it to be able to see this being done and all I'm doing is just twisting the hair you guys the hair is very long and as I'm twisting this hair all the way down sorry you guys so just in case you guys don't know how to twist and that is not an insult to anyone some people don't. All I'm doing is just making sure that I gather all the hair and I twist as I go. Okay, this is what it looks like. And I'm twisting all the way down. I may leave some hair out on the end. And actually what I'm going to do from this point is now that I have the hair twisted you see how this braid is already attached to the ponytail well I'm just going to take my hand and stationary it put it in place in other words and I'm just going to hold it while I wrap this ponytail around okay now I'm also going to take that hair and even though I know it's sticking out, I'm going to tuck it in and I'm going to take one of my trusty pins, hair pins, decorative accessory, a flower, and I'm going to pin it in place. Now, the reason why I am using pins and pinning it in place and not doing it on my head is because I wanted you guys to be able to see how you can still get a bang for your buck and still decorate your hair piece. Now, this isn't easy, you guys. I'm going to be really honest with you. Um... But where there's a will, there's a way. And you just really, what you're looking to do is to pin it without your pin showing, but also keeping the hair in place so that it does not unravel. So pretty much that is what I'm doing when I'm sticking these pins in. And also I'm using a little decoration to decorate the hair piece. Now I did put a couple of those pins in and I do have more, but I also like to add, and this is a butterfly and it has a cuff. So what I'm going to do is just find an area in the hair piece and just hold it in place. So, let me show you guys what it looks like. So you don't have to stick the butterfly there. I just did that. And then you just stick in a couple of pins in. You can stick them where you want. Um, you don't actually have to do this bun hairstyle. You can also take the hair and you can take a bobby pin 
if you feel like that's too high for you or you can tuck the hair down some more and you can pan. It just really is your preference. The only reason why I did it on a mannequin head as an example is just in case if you don't know how to actually create a bun style and this will give you the confidence of being able to practice on a mannequin head because if you can get it here and and get it pinned down you can do anything once you put it onto your head and then in no time you can actually do it with the hair piece pinned down already and you can just wrap and go and put your accessories in but if you're new to this and you're not sure how to go about doing it this was a demonstration for you so that you can get more bang for your buck and get the value out of your ponytail and also even if it's a ponytail that's straight and you know it tangles a lot it doesn't mean it can't be used it can definitely be used you just need another option and alternative on how you can create that style and with that being said this is why I wanted to make sure that I brought a demonstration and showed you guys how you can do this demonstrating it on a mannequin head and you don't have to use these pins you can use bobby pins it's fine but if you're looking to add accessories and you want to glam it up this is the purpose and the reason for this demonstration tutorial video all right you guys i'll see you in the next video